When the 49ers beat the Lions in the NFC Championship game, Retro Junkie Sports Bar in Walnut Creek was packed. But co-owner Enrique Montero feels Sunday will be different. There is something different. I mean, after finally winning the championship game after three years and getting through, it's time to get some payback on the Chiefs. That payback will be televised at their huge Super Bowl party. The big beer garden has been prepped with a 15-foot LED screen, tents, surround sound, and food. We got food trucks, uh, barbecue, of course. Um, we got all sorts of games, raffles, squares, stuff like that. We got a, a, a DJs before, uh, during commercial breaks, and after the game, hopefully we're celebrating. My family, uh, big Niner fans, grandfather sold, you know, seat cushions and, and programs at Kizar. Um, so it's in my blood. Mark Trapani will keep the family tradition alive at Rotator Taproom Bar, also in Walnut Creek. He says their loyal 49er fan base will pack the place. Six TVs, food trucks, and of course, there will be games. Cameras pass by Taylor Swift, everybody's got a drink. <laughs> Despite being Raider territory, downtown Oakland will be another hotspot for the 49er gang. At Feelmore Social, Nina Joyner will be serving up a special Super Bowl cocktail and a viewing party. She's a Vegas native and a Raiders fan, so she has mixed feelings. The reason why I came out to the Bay Area is because of all of the sports teams. It's bittersweet for me. But I'm really happy for a city of San Francisco. This is really good for them, and I also think it's good for Oakland because, you know, a lot of people are going to be watching. Saturday night, San Francisco landmarks were lit up in red and gold. But that sense that a 49ers Super Bowl win isn't just about San Francisco, it's something that seems to resonate across the Bay Area. San Francisco and the Bay Area needs this win. You know, with everything going on and San Francisco being kind of drugged through with, with all that kind of political stuff, I just think that this is something that we could be proud of with the whole world, uh, the Bay Area, and especially San Francisco, bringing this home. As they say, do it for the Bay. In San Francisco, on Hassan, ABC7 Eyewitness News.